In this video, we'll show you the top six ways to e-sign your documents for free. And while some methods are faster and others more secure, your preferences and needs will play a big role in which methods you use to create and sign online. This video includes multiple chapters, so feel free to skip ahead to the parts that interest you the most. All right, let's get started. The simplest and most straightforward way to create a digital signature is to simply sign your name using a pen and paper, take a photo of it, and upload it to a digital device. Here's how you do it. First, write your name on a piece of white paper using a ballpoint pen. Black or blue ink is preferable. Next, using your smartphone, tablet, or home scanner, take a photo or scan the image of your signature. Afterwards, you can use digital tools like your smartphone editor or an online photo editor to neatly crop your handwritten signature into an acceptable size. If your signature file was created in a JPEG format, you'll need to convert it to a PNG format for use when signing digital documents. Use an online conversion tool like JPEG to PNG to quickly and easily convert your file type. Once you have a PNG file of your signature, you can sign Microsoft Word and Google Doc files by dragging and dropping your new signature onto your document and placing it above the signature line in the document. There you have it. One final note on this method. While it's somewhat simple and convenient, it comes with a few downsides. Signatures created this way aren't as secure as those created using dedicated software. You won't have a digital ID or a digital certificate proving the authenticity of the signature. This workflow will feel totally tedious when you learn about the other ways to create electronic signatures. A really easy way to create a free electronic signature is to do it online with this website, createmysignature.com. Here's how you do it. Go to the Create My Signature website and select Draw Signature. Next, draw an image of your signature using your mouse, cursor, or touchscreen device. If you don't like the result, Use the eraser button in the top right to try again. Once you've got a signature that you're happy with, click or tap download to download a PNG version of your signature. Afterwards, just drag and drop the signature image into a Word document or Google Docs file for fast and easy signing. There are a ton of free tools available to help you create e-signatures online. This one is our favorite because it's fast, easy, simple, and free. It doesn't require any scanning equipment or photos. You can even sign PDF documents by uploading the PDF to their secure and anonymous online portal. Not sure if you knew this or not, but you can actually create e-signatures inside of Microsoft Word. Here's how you do it. First, open up a Word document and place the cursor where you'd like your signature line to go. Next, go to the Insert tab and under Text, click Signature List, followed by Microsoft Office Signature Line. Complete the fields about signature details in the Setup box that pops up and select your preferences for the signature box. Then, right-click on the signature box in the document. Choose Select Image to upload an image of a signature that you already have. You can also draw your signature using a touchscreen device or type a printer version into the signature box. There you have it. This does place an image of your signature on the page, but it's a relatively insecure e-signing method. Anyone with a copy of your signature could sign a document using this method. For that reason, we always advise using a secure and encrypted signing method like those provided by e-signature platforms when trying to create secure and legally binding documents. One way to create a free and secure electronic signature is by using the PandaDoc free e-sign plan. Here's how you can do it. Start by signing up for the PandaDoc free e-sign plan. By the way, there's no credit card required but there's a limit of five e-signatures per month. Upload a document you've already created. One great thing about PandaDoc is that it supports multiple document types. Next, just add a signature field to your document. Then, set up the required signers. If you're sending the document for signature, use the tools inside PandaDoc to email or share a link to the recipient. If you have fields assigned to yourself, hit the Fill and Sign button to complete them. You can sign by uploading a signature image, drawing, or typing your name. Wait for other recipients to complete the signing process. Simple as can be. You've just created and sent a document for electronic signature for free. While PandaDoc offers free A signatures, they also have tons of other features to improve your workflow, like templates, a drag and drop document editor, payment processing features, 
and more. But you'll have to get a paid plan to access all that cool stuff. If you're using a Mac, you can actually create an electronic signature for free and sign PDF. Here's how you do it. First, open the Preview app. Then, click the Show Markup Toolbar button. But if the Markup Toolbar isn't showing, click the Sign button here. Then, use your trackpad as prompted and sign your name using your finger. Press any key and then click Done. If you don't like the results, click Clear and try again. You can also create a signature by using your computer's built-in camera or your iPhone or iPad. When you click the Sign button inside the Preview app, you can drag your signature image over the signature line and use the text tool to add the date, if required. Then just close the document to save the signature. One quick note. This method can be difficult if you want to use your signature in another app like Apple Mail, and you can't make any substantial changes to PDFs or other types of documents. The last method for creating an electronic signature we want to show you is with Adobe Acrobat. Adobe has been in the electronic document space for decades. The company is responsible for the PDF format, which was invented back in the early 90s with the use of Adobe Acrobat and Adobe Reader. Here's how you do it. Start by uploading your document to Acrobat Sign using the Upload button on your dashboard. Sign up for a free Adobe account or sign in with your existing account to proceed. Scroll to the page where you would like to place your signature. Then click the Add Signature button on the left sidebar. Enter your name by typing, drawing, or uploading a signature image, like the image you created using Create My Signature or through the draw and scan method demonstrated earlier. Once you've signed the document, click Save. The signature will now appear in the sidebar. Drag and drop your signature onto the document. When you're done, hit the Download button at the top of the screen to download the signed copy of the document. You can also request additional e-signatures by clicking on the Request e-signatures button. While Acrobat has powerful PDF editing tools built into their platform, you're required to create an account and the workflow can feel a bit cumbersome and unintuitive. That's it. Six different ways to create an electronic signature. After looking at the pros and cons of these methods, we have to say Create My Signature is probably our favorite because it's fast, easy, simple, and free. It doesn't require any scanning equipment or photos. And you can even sign PDF documents by uploading the PDF to their secure and anonymous online portal. Thank you.